Yes, I'm Lee Riding Bush. I'm from Muscatine, Iowa. Been here a good chunk of my life, farmed a good chunk of my life, like 60 years. My wife seemed to think I need to get out of the business. So I said, well, okay, whatever, boss. So I found that the secret of a successful marriage is two words, yes, dear, so. Yes, the bulk of the equipment hasn't been used since like 2020. That's kind of when I retired. And then I had some health issues. I had a grandson, didn't know for sure what was gonna happen. And at this stage, I thought, okay, I'm out. And so we're having a sale. Uh, the bulk of the equipment's low hours and always shed it outside of field equipment. Yeah, the two Massey tractors, the 7626 were kind of in an interesting situation in 2014 where I needed another tractor in a hurry and decided to buy it even though the main tractor is the 7624. The 7626, if I remember correctly, has like 240 horse and the other tractor is like 220 if you're looking at horsepower. Really haven't had any problems with either tractor, and the one tractor is in that 220 hour range, so it's a long way from being worn out. Uh, not much more I can say about it, I just haven't been overworked by any stretch. The uh, vertical till has, is a long way from being worn out. It hasn't really been over too many acres. I had roughly 800 acres in row crop of my own, and there were fair number of years that I had seed corn so the equipment didn't get used. The corn head or the combine on that, of course they picked that. Then we also had green beans so the equipment didn't get used on that. They do all the harvesting and uh, the planter, we do plant the green beans with the planter. But uh, the grain cart, if I remember right, we bought it in like 2018 so it's and really was not only used on whatever commercial grain acres I had that year, which was not very many. None of this stuff has left the farm. All of it was used on this farm. Uh, so for whatever that's worth. As far as I know, everything's good to go. Mm -hmm.